Hey, what's up guys? So today I just wanted to do a video on how to lower your car in Photoshop. Uh, it's a pretty simple way to go from to go from this down to this. So pretty simple, uh, not too much involved with this. So basically you're just going to drag your photo into Photoshop here. And then all you're going to want to do is you go up to the left here and click on the polygonal lasso tool. So you want to click that. We're going to zoom in here. We can zoom, we don't have to go that much. All right, so basically the idea is, is we take the top image and then kind of just bring it down. So what you want to do is at the bottom of the car here, uh, you want to start from the left side and just drag a straight line all the way to the car here. And then we're just going to slowly pick out the bottom of the car here. So as you can see here, we're just getting it close. You don't have to get it perfect. Um, but get it as get as good as you can. Like I like I said before, it doesn't need to be perfect, but because we can fix it and tune it a little bit later. But we're just gonna go all around the fender, the inner fender, or the top of the fender rather on the car here. Let's keep grab, keep going. Let me get to the bottom here. We're gonna grab the 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 side skirt as well, go all the way here, and then grab the top of the fender again inside here and I'm just clicking here clicking as we're going okay now we're gonna grab the bottom of the bumper here the muffler tip and then we're gonna head straight out the back click on the outside here outside of the picture we're gonna go all the way up and basically do a whole box around the top of the image here and we're gonna complete it now all we're gonna do is copy and paste this so we're gonna hit control C control V which pastes it all right so now that <clears throat> now that we copied and pasted it back out here a little bit um, we're gonna go to the layer you just created by copying and pasting it's gonna be layer one and all you're gonna do is grab it and just slightly bring it down a little bit to wherever you want it so you can you, know, you can slam it or whatever you want lift it up Whatever. We'll, we'll set it like we'll set it there all right so now to kind of clean this up and make this look a little better uh, we're gonna zoom in here and this is where I where I was saying like if you didn't get it perfect it's not the end of the world but here we can just kind of clean this up so if you see any like this black is kind of overlapping a little bit go to the eraser tool which is over on the left here and then this is what I have for my settings I have it set on this guy over here sizes you can kind of create different sizes depending on how big of an area you want to touch up mine's a little smaller so I want to go smaller with this uh, I have hardness at, harshness at 0% I have it mode brush and opacity 55 uh, and you can just kind of play around with that but this is pretty good but I'm just gonna clean up any like black edges that I had forgotten which it seems pretty good actually and the good thing about it is when you're lowering a car generally there's a lot of black space in here just because your car is you know so high high up in the air that uh, this black area kind of blends with itself so uh, to kind of clean up this area here you can see we do have a kind of a harsh line here I'm just gonna create the size of the uh, eraser to a little bigger and then just kind of just slowly try to blend it a little better so it's not so harsh so you can see I just kind of blended that a little nicely here same here you see this harsh harsh line here it's gonna slowly I'm clicking and dragging and just kind of erasing just trying to blend it as much as possible so you really wouldn't notice looking at it so now we're gonna zoom out now so there you go that's just a simple way here's before there's the after so it's pretty simple just to get an idea of what your car looks like lowered so yeah but yeah, that's it guys. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, a thumbs down. And if you like these kind of videos, uh, let me know in the comments below. And I will see you guys in the next video.